and welcome back to Talos Game. Once again. I think I'm going to make them both. They disappeared. Oh, a fragment.
L. Raposo. Alright. Thank God for this very... Coincidentally shaped. or not. I doubt it is painless. But more because I don't want to lose my progress. Don't want to lose my progress because of that. Oh. Now I have to get through this office. But... Some people just don't realize what a scumbag they are. Pay back time, you piece of shit. I love revolvers. I'm mostly terrified because of the fucking sticky bomb. Bad throw. Yeah, I'm my
Now I have to climb all that again. gun. My fucking assault rifle is gone now.
I don't know why there's so many guns laid around. Not like we're gonna use these. Is the game was anticipating us with lots of equipment. Appreciate the gesture. But like like fluttering the place. Oh, there's a respawn point up here. That would have been so helpful to have known. Alright, let's, let's try this again. I am so glad they have this here. Like, my god. It's super fucking useful. I am a lot more optimistic now that I know this info. I don't believe in myself. Okay, that's a bit harsh, but like, you know. I can only get the pipe back this way. this in a while. That rolled perfectly towards them. They both are dead. Whew. Got it. Touch boss fight. Oh, it's a luxury penthouse.
I'll come back later. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is the only area I can go through. Well, for the sake of dramatic effect. A luxury place. Luxurious, isn't it? Huh? Engravings. Hate these. I hate people that unironically engrave these. Finally. I always pictured you taller. Better looking. Likewise. <laughs> Legendary tourist quip. I suppose I should be flattered. Sunrise is beautiful from up here. I never miss one. I'm not interested in the rising sun. Of course not. You have another agenda. Today was supposed to be a celebration, but it has turned into a day of reckoning. You deserve a reckoning. Brought it upon yourself. You're a monster. Perhaps I deserved reckoning, but I am no monster, Tori. I simply have the courage to make the difficult decision. I agonized over what had to be done this time. The destruction of my beloved city. I take zero pleasure in it. But I am curious. Through the eyes of a legendary lone wolf, why do you think I would even consider such a course of action? You're afraid. Afraid of the alternatives? Yes. I was just like everyone else, tourist. I believed the reserve was salvation. But fate had other plans. When you uncovered that empty hole in the ground, I had to pivot. I spent weeks crunching the numbers. Only one thing became clear. Without a culling, starvation and disease would overtake us all in a matter of months. I had a choice to make. Allow fate to run its chaotic course once again and surrender the entire city to the dead. Or defy fate, take matters into my own hands, and save a precious few by slaughtering the many. I chose defiance. What you chose was mass murder. I chose the future. The tower as an art for those with the metal to rebuild a new world. Turning my back on so many people I loved in favor of pure survival. Can you even comprehend how difficult that is? But none of it matters now, does it? The bells ring, the plan is set in motion, but my victory is hollow. Treachery is everywhere. And I am alone. Where did I go wrong? Tell me. Your plan is fucked up, regardless of what your numbers say. The plan is sound, Torres. You know this to be true. Every second that passes without a reset plunges this city further into irreversible doom. No. The plan is not the problem here. It was a treachery. Surrounded by traitors. Never knowing when the knife will plunge into your back. Feeling paranoid? They got pills for that, you know. There is no cure for what ails me, Torres. I've come to accept that. 
Roots of treachery have dug their way deep into my story. Choking the life out of me from within. The bodies around the table inside, they were not the first to betray me. One of them poisoned this drink. Their mind corrupted by some movement within my lower ranks. The assassin would not reveal themselves, of course. So my hand was forced. Garrick and May? I considered them family. But their ambition outweighed their loyalty. I learned they were plotting to murder me in my sleep, tourist. Simply because we didn't see eye to eye on how to manage the tower population. Like a fool, I spared them. Thought they would come to their senses outside the tower walls, on the run and alone. I was wrong. And then there was JB, my right hand. There were warning signs early on that the pressure was getting to him. That he was on the verge of snapping. But I dismissed them. I loved him like my own son. Protected him That's when nice. others called for his head. And how did he repay my loyalty? He tried to burn me alive and started a war. Over ideology. Every decision I have made has been in the service of other people, tourist. With a target on my back the entire time. My head on the block waiting for the blade to drop. No more. One second. Great leaders inspire loyalty in their people, and they keep it. But I could not. Look out over our glorious city, tourist. Tell me, what do you see? I see opportunity. You sound like me. So long ago, this is the key to the city's future. It unlocks a control panel behind you. There is a button that will turn off the lights, and without the lights, the bells will fall silent. But heed my words, Taurus. Letting the bells ring is an act of mercy. The slate will be wiped clean, and only those with the fortitude necessary to preserve humanity will remain and rebuild. They will thrive. But if you silence the, the bells, you will only prolong the suffering for all. The fate of this city will be sealed. The dead will prevail. I've made my choice and have paid the price for it. Now, it is time for you to make yours. Ring. Well done. You are a servant to the greater good. Like yeah, myself. No point. Welcome home, tourist. You know, it would really suck if you.
I was gonna say it would really suck if she lost her footing. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, okay. Okay, just stand on the edge. Well, tourist. Look like you chose to end this tale in flames. Not the path I'd have taken, but what do I know? I'm just a dead man. No different from all those folks whose fate you seal by allowing the bells to toll. Blah, 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 blah. New heaven. She saw something in you, tourists. A kindred spark. I know you like to think of yourself as the lone wolf, but take a moment to contemplate this. She may have been playing you the whole while got exactly what she wanted from the only soul she thought capable of taking her place. But you're the one left standing. The one who has to deal with the aftermath. Oh, Good fuck. luck with that tourist. Shit. You're sure as hell gonna need it. Yeah, maybe that was a bad idea. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. That's it? Can I skip this? Oh my god. Okay, good. Alright. So I know the bus is fucked. So we're not gonna go back there, right? It's flooded with Zeds. Or, oh, I'm sorry. Walkers. And we are back here. Okay. And Jesus fucking Christ. What have I done? Well, at least my home's fucking safe, right? I was dead. Everyone is dead. What have I done? No, I probably shouldn't do that. tower presence is still increasing. Mama's dead. <sighs> oh, that's why we didn't hear from Mama. Because she was recovering from her fucking burns. Med supply located. Bastion. Medicine cash found. Buy one. Let's try this again. This time, we are not going to let the city burn. Oh, no. Oh, let's go through this again. Oh, man. Well, uh, let's at least have some fun.
What's in here? Oh my god. You messed up starting shit with Fucking hell. You must be stupid showing your There's face around. <clears throat> So I was a little overconfident. I'm in.
Let's not drop the gun this time. the grenade. Did I get him? No, it oh. did not. I don't think he spots me. No. <gasps> Come on, get in. Damn it. Hmm. 
God, this fucker. No bandages. Bandages. I thought that was a guard. No, it's just a side. Oh my god. Kill everyone. Fuck out of here. There's a lot of these here. Come on, medical supplies anywhere, please. I beg of you. What is this? Ammo. Uh, I need medical supplies. I need. I'm gonna put on the primary. Okay, so if I fucking die here, that stuff is gone. That has unique items inside. So we're not gonna die. Intentionally, at least. We're not intending to. Oh my god, thank the gods. Thank the lord, we're done here. On what a mess. Idle hands are the devil's plaything. Box of goodies. There's large boxes everywhere. In here. Someone's a torture.
Damn, there's a grand fucking kitchen out here. Damn, I missed out on so much stuff last time. Ammo boxes! Whoa, what? What's in here? Nothing. Literally nothing. What's this? Foods. Jerky. Ah, it's empty. See? Empty. Bandages, thank the lord. <sighs> oh. food. It's got proteins. I could give two shits. I'll say I could give less of a fuck. But mama. Because unlike my actual mother, I don't respect her. Fucking killed so many people for her master plan. Which, mind you, is fucking retarded. Why did I say that? Look at the fucking bed she sleeps on. Look at this shit, man. Surprised the interaction didn't happen sooner. She's literally got marble fucking bathrooms. What else is there? There's a second floor. Literally gold gilded rooms. Okay, so the main reason I'm actually doing this is because, well, one, loot. Two, there's a fucking schematic here. It's just, well, one of the schematics said something about the tower. And I'm gonna find it. Because I doubt I'm gonna be able to come back here. We found the armory. Oh, full of worn ones, though. You'd think the top floor would have, like, custom weapons. Nope. Worn down bullshit. <sighs> what a fucking disappointment this place is. Oh, wow, you can actually access this floor, is so. Oh, this is where she sits to enjoy the view. The bitch. Honestly. Honest to God, though, where the fuck is it? Is that a coffee? <sighs> Honestly, though, where the fuck is the schematic? Note, or whatever the fuck we want to call them. Ah, <sighs> oh, these things really do not heal much. But at least I don't have that blood mark on my screen anymore. Should I kill her with this? Oh, fuck me, we're full. Can make more medicine. Ah, I fucking broke it. Oh, and there's more. There's more rooms. I'm guessing the higher up. Oops, fucking sleep in these. If they don't, I'm 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 just. I'll be surprised if the fucking higher ups don't sleep in those rooms, like the top officers of the tower. You have arrived. 
Finally. I always pictured you taller. Fuck you. Better looking. You greet all your guests with such terrible manners? Only honored guests. Sunrise is beautiful from up here. I never miss one. I'm not interested in the rising sun. Of course not. You have another agenda. Today was supposed to be a celebration. But it has turned into a day of reckoning. No argument from me. You think I'm a monster, don't you? That I enjoy this carnage and misery? Nothing could be further from the truth. I agonized over what had to be done this time. The destruction of my beloved city. I take zero pleasure in it. But I am curious. Through the eyes of a legendary lone wolf, why do you think I would even consider such a course of action? You're crazy. Crazy is to put your head in the sand and ignore reality. I was just like everyone else, tourist. I believed the reserve was salvation. But fate had other plans. When you uncovered that empty hole in the ground, I had to pivot. I spent weeks crunching the numbers. Only one thing became clear. Without a culling, starvation and disease would overtake us all in a matter of months. I had a choice to another make. way to do it. Allow fate to run its chaotic course once again and surrender the entire city to the dead. Or defy fate. Take matters into my own hands. And save a precious few by slaughtering the many. I chose defiance. What you chose was... I chose the future. The tower as an art for those with the metal to rebuild a new world. Turning my back on so many people I loved. In favor of pure survival. Can you even comprehend how difficult that is? But none of it matters now, does it? The bells ring. The plan is set in motion. My victory is hollow. Treachery is everywhere. And I am alone. Where did I go wrong? Tell me. You messed with me. Big mistake. Nothing personal, tourist. For what it's worth, I always had a feeling we would have a chat like this. You and I are very much alive. It's like we're twins. We're survivors, tourist. Whatever the cost. And for me, that cost has gotten unbearably high. The roots of treachery have dug their way deep into my story. Choking the life out of me from within. The bodies around the table inside, they were not the first to betray me. One of them poisoned this drink. Their mind corrupted by some movement within my lower ranks. The assassin would not reveal himself, of course. So my hand was forced. Garrick and May? I considered them family. But their ambition outweighed their loyalty. I learned they were plotting to murder me in my sleep, tourist. Simply because we didn't see eye to eye on how to manage the tower population. A fool I spared them. Thought they would come to their senses inside the tower walls, on the run and alone. I was wrong. And then there was JB, my right hand. There were warning signs early on that the pressure was getting to him that he was on the verge of snapping. But I dismissed them. I loved him like my own son. Protected him when others called for his head. And how did he repay my loyalty? 
He tried to burn me alive and started a war over ideology. Every decision I have made has been in the service of other people, tourists. With the target on my back the entire time. You know, there's one thing I don't understand is how the fuck I was waiting for the plane to drop. Like, were there survivors in there? In each of those no, spots? No. That's a pretty sad tale. It is the path I chose. I have no regrets. Look out over our glorious city, tourist. Tell me. What do you see? I see death. After death, there is new life, tourist. If you give it the means to flourish, this is the key to the city's future. It unlocks a control panel behind you. <clears throat> there is a button that will turn off the lights, and without the if lights, the bells early, will fall will she silent. The but heed my words, tourist. Letting the bells ring is an act of mercy. The slate will be wiped clean, and only those with the fortitude necessary to preserve humanity will remain and rebuild. They will thrive. But if you silence the bells, you will only prolong the suffering for all. The fate of this city will be sealed. The dead will prevail. Oh no. I've made my choice and have paid the price for it. Now, it is time for you to make yours. Give me the key. The demon in disguise. Why am I not surprised? Welcome to hell, tourist. Fuck you. Yeah, well, boys, we did it. Oh. God, that is so fucking dumb. Looks like you chose to raise the city up on your shoulders instead of raising it to the ground. I guess you could say I'm a bit surprised. Didn't take you for an optimist. Manola ain't out of the woods just yet. Mama may be gone, but the darkness she embraced didn't start or end with her. It's still out there, tourist. Deep in the souls of the living, biding its time. Now, of course, there's light out there, too. That spark of humanity. And with a dash of hope, that spark will grow into a rage in the fire. And spread to every corner of this new world. All thanks to you, tourists. Freedom. We're done. Done with this game. Why did I say that like I hate it? I love this game. Ugh. I'll say I'm just. Well, actually, I'm, 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 I finally got the damn story done so I can replay it again. God damn it. You know, there's one thing I don't understand. Oh, of course, Via Carola's still on. Oh, hey, Old Town's live. Yay, I can go back to Old Town. Fucking fine. Well... We got tons of loot. Gun. 
gun, gun, another gun, another gun, flashlight, gun, 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 food, gun. Knife for an order. Over. Gun to the pile. It's still not there. <sighs> no, that's weird. Via Corolla still isn't safe. Which is weird. <sighs> oh, yeah, there's no way of fucking presenting this one as well. Because to get through all of it, you need to go through. Sense that you need to go through the entire first game and put a save. No place like home. Gone camping at the skyscraper. Discovered. That's a lot of bindings. Weapon hall discovered. By water. Well, we're going to the bar water. <laughs> Okay, we'll go to Old Town, find that cooking recipe. I did not notice that one. Safe room? Uh, oh, right, that's for the reinforced bar, I think. Yeah. I don't know what that's for. Oh, right, because this one was done by Grick. The bastard. Holy shit. No. 
You have no actual use for anything but that. What the fuck was that noise? Really was Okay, now I'm terrified. No. I'm so glad they didn't unlock who the zombies wearing that armor to be bulletproof. It would have been just a dick. What the fuck was that noise though? Uh. What is that noise? Oh yeah. This area. This is the whole fucking teaser thing. I'm in. I'm surprised I actually kept this in. This place is just a paper stockpile. Putting papers over. a fucking zombie crow bitch on the roof. I'd like that to Because it is really loud and annoying. Like seriously, please.
super fucking difficult. Gumbo. Trust about leaving again. Anyway. 